Okay, example three, we want to show that the function or curve f of x here is always increasing. So we want to show that it's always increasing for any value of x. So what that means then is we're going to get the first derivative, f dashed x. And then we have to show that our expression for f dashed x is somehow always going to be bigger than zero. Okay, so let's get the first derivative first. So our general gradient is f dashed x. So we're ready to differentiate. So f dashed x is equal to, so multiply this term by its power. So we're going to get 12 over 3x and then subtract 1 from the power. Then we're going to get minus 12x plus 9. Okay, now tidy up the fraction. So this is, if you like, our expression for f dashed x. So if the curve is always increasing, then we want to show that f dashed x is always bigger than zero. In other words, always positive. So we want to show that f dashed x is always bigger than zero, in other words, positive. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're actually going to factorize here. So our product is going to be plus 36, and our sum is going to be negative 12. And that means our two numbers are going to be minus 6 and minus 6. So we're going to have 4x squared minus 6x minus 6x plus 9. So split it down the middle and then factorize each half. So I'm lifting out 2x. So in brackets I'm going to have 2x minus 3. And then I'm going to have the same bracket over here. And then I must be lifting out minus 3. And factorize one more time. So we're going to get 2x minus 3 upon 2x minus 3. In other words, we're going to have 2x minus 3 all squared. Now that's perfect. We've got a bracket to the power of 2, a single bracket to the power of 2. So that's what f dashed x is. So no matter what value of x we sub in here, even if it's negative, the fact that the outer power is 2 will always produce a positive result. So in other words, if what you end up in brackets here is positive, you square it, it's still positive. If what you end up in brackets here is negative, you square it, it becomes positive. So this will always be positive. So therefore, since f dashed x is always positive, in other words, greater than zero, then the curve f of x is always increasing. So great little question there. It's wanting you to prove or show that a curve is always increasing or indeed always decreasing. So get the first derivative and then actually factorize it and hopefully you'll end up with a single bracket with a power of 2 and that's always going to be positive for any value of x that you sub in.